onomatopoeia. Onomatopoeia. Ophthalmoplegia. Ophthalmoplegia. I can hear her. No, I, I, I listen, but she's mute. No, no she, she, she's non speako <laughs> Nothing. No, I don't give a flying fuck about the delivery. There's no film without a last scene, and no last scene without her. I need her voice. Right? Okay. Right, 6 p.m. This evening? Okay, no bother. Okay, bye. Bye, 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 I could uh, certainly ask. Uh, room uh, 17. <clears throat> Luggage? Uh, no. Here you are. Have a um, good stay. <clears throat> It'll all work out, I'm sure. It won't. When one is as quintessentially beautiful as you. The sun will shine. Y you watch. To the wedding, will you have some tempura prawn or something? I'm vegetarian, you dick. Are you? Nigel, don't go in. Nigel, Nigel, wait. She ran away for a reason. Oh, yeah, leaving me back there looking like a muppet. No one leaves me looking like a muppet. Oh, mate. You've seen an erotic bride this tall, mad as a box of frogs. Sorry? Look, I need, I need the manager. We need the manager. He's not going to fucking tell us out. Well, he can't tell us anything. Guest confidentiality. I presume you are her betrothed. What? I, I'm a fella. Look, where the fuck is she? I'm afraid I am bound by guest client. Listen, mate, any second now, these roses are in right up your arse. Where is she? Nige, leave her. She'll calm down. Look, why don't we get a drink, yeah? Sex on the beach. You'll love those. Sort you right out. No, no, I need this sorted. Ah. Uh, sorry, I... Are you okay? Yeah. Really? Uh, I just wanted to... Uh, uh, anyway. <laughs> uh, have a good day. Or, um... Anyway, I, 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 uh, I hope it gets better. <laughs> yes, uh, thank you. Okay, uh, well, cheerio, bye. Uh, toodaloo. Fucking toodaloo. <laughs> <laughs>
Look, he's OCD. He'll still be here tomorrow if you don't let him speak to her. And I can't imagine the boss liking this nut job scaring guests. So how about you give us a room number, he goes up, she tells him to get lost. Five minutes, it's over. She won't even have to open the door. What do you say? Oi! Fuck do you think you're doing, eh? He's a fool. Yeah, piss off, will you? Nary ball. You say your bit and then we go, OK? All right, listen, will you keep it zipped about us, yeah? Chicky, chicky! It, it, it's me. It's Foxy Loxy. <laughs> babe. Babe, come on, let me in. I love you, you know that, don't you? But come on. A foxy loves Chicky. Come on, babe. Why have you followed me? Go away. Lucy, hear him out. You bitch. Two-faced cow. Loose. Leave me alone. Both of you, leave me alone. It's not what you think. You slept with my fiance. Yeah. You were on Tinder. Nice one for a bloke about to get married. No, it's a joke. Oh, my God. You are so funny. Is that the sound of my ribs cracking, or have you just lied through your teeth? Oh, look, she's jealous. Of all the things I feel right now, like putrid self-loathing, jealousy isn't one of them. Look, I made a mistake, all right? A big one. Babe, but you're the only one I've ever wanted. I'll look after you. Care for you. Love you too. We're both old and grey in our wheelchairs, yeah? Looking out to sea. Yeah, with our great-grandchildren playing by our feet. Excuse me, I might just be a little bit sick. Look, I made a mistake. Are we not allowed just one mistake? Please, please. Please forgive me. Foxy loves chicky. <laughs> No. Oh, oh, ah, ah, oh. I, I'm sorry. So sorry. I was. I don't trust him. Okay. Okay. Outside they were. Listen, he's just not to be trusted. <laughs> right. I've pretty well had enough of you, you tan lug chucker. What? Look. Why don't we all calm down? Why do people do it? I mean, it's such a cliche to say that we all wear tartan. You have to believe me. You're my best friend. Am I? Luce, everyone was gossiping. I got my nails done last Saturday. The woman next to me was talking about her mate who just had a threesome with a bloke called Nige. Hardly proof. Who was about to get married. The bloke had a banana tattoo. OK. Next but why did you sleep with him? He's a cheating prick and you wouldn't listen. Me, Jane and Mila found him on Tinder and drew straws who'd shag him. I lost. Decide what you want for you. Not your family, not for him, you. Then make it happen. We've had a complaint about noise. Go away. Show me she's okay. I need to see her. What? I'm calling the police unless I see she's all right. There. There, you at me now? Seen enough? Oh, piss off. Babe, come on. Babe, come on, we've, we've got a wedding to go to. For the last three months, all I've thought about is weddings. What dresses make you look hot. Virginal, sophisticated, and a size eight, all at the same time. What to do if the flower girl has her usual spoiled brattish meltdown? 
And what will I do if even though I've put them in different corners of the room, my parents choose my wedding to pick over their nasty divorce? Will my brother stay sober long enough to say his speech? And why do my teeth always look yellow in photos? Does the fat between your thighs look more squidgy in stockings rather than tights? And how am I going to eat anything when the dress is already far too small because I told the dressmaker I'd lose weight when I know I have no self-discipline? And you know what? I'm tired. It's shit, all of it. Lucy, I've spent the last two years thinking about every other bugger but me. And I don't want to do it anymore. Good for you. From now on, I call the shots. Um... All that stuff about us in our wheelchairs, it's from an advert. What? It's... Before the last Spider-Man film, we saw it together. You laughed and said that if that was me and you, you'd probably have let my tires down or pushed me off a cliff. I was, I was joking. So now, you philandering piece of poo, you're going back to the church to tell everyone how the wedding is cancelled but you couldn't keep your dick in your pants. You, you're going to ring the gang, sort us out a case of fizz and meet back here. And you... Thank you for caring, but I don't need you. And you? Well, you're just cute. Hang on a minute, so you're gonna run off with him now, are you? Not today, but who knows? Right, come on then, let's get you out of here. No, yeah. no, you get out. All of you. Fallen in love, have we? Well, let me tell you, mate, she is one heap of trouble. Oh, I know, I know she looks all right, but she's as mad as a hamster in a blender. And you can't see it now, because she's got this armpit hair. Enough, like... yeah. Fine. Fine, you have my blessing, reception boy. I've got plenty of other foxy fish to find, isn't that right, sweet shape? Okay. okay. When we did it, it wasn't because I fancy you. I did it for her. What? She needed to know what a low life you were. So someone had to go there, me. But it worked. She knows who you really are. Job done. Fucking nailed it. So, so, so you set me up? And just a word of advice. That banana tattoo, not good. Off-putting, especially when... Let's just leave it at that, shall we? He'll get over it. Can I ask? Your friend. I mean, I don't want to come across as opportunistic or quixotic or, or, or nothing, but do you think that she... Okay. Here's what you do. I just wanted to say sorry for dragging you into my mess. I've known him years. We grew up together, actually, in the same village. And it was just assumed we'd be together. Like, we both loved horses and comics. Then going into the city and staying up all night. And it was just assumed we'd be together. How do you learn? No, I, I, I listen, but she's mute. Charming it's shit, nice. all of it. I spent the last Funny two years happened. thinking about every other bugger that got me. It's not her last scene. And the last scene that I need her. her voice. From now on, I call the shots. But deep down, 
I didn't love him. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, goodbye. Ha 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 ha!